Hey guys, it's Erica. So excited to be checking this out. We're checking out Xenary Heroes. Good enough. Very, very excited. They just, I mean, I really, really love them as a group and I really, really love their music. Like, there's just something about it that they're like, every single song that I have on my playlist, which is like every single song they release, it's a no skip for me. They they just, I don't know, they're so good. They sound so different. They tickle the right part of my brain, you know what I mean? Like, it, it allows me to get like my K-pop fix, but like my rock fix in one, but also flow in a playlist where it feels really nice. But I kind of don't throw them in like my rock playlist because that's like my, my emo vibes, you know what I mean? But for sure, I'm, they're, they're just like it's again tickling the right parts of my brain their music and it's been such an amazing time checking them out but yeah really excited to be checking out good enough you guys can expect a lot more reactions a lot more regularly at least for the next few months hopefully um good for the channel bad for my financial situation that there's a writer's strike um but yeah that's whatever but anyways really excited so you know what it like um Is it gonna be all in English? Huh, interesting. Not like so surprising, but interesting. Okay, vocals come in, come in. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm talking about. Get out, get out, get out. He's not actually driving, he's on a rig. So don't be freaked out that he's not watching the road. I don't think they're going to do the big ending. What, like, a powerful group. Like, 
they can give like the fun rock songs they can give emotional ones like this which i really really love that they were able to do this not a lot of is it their first like rock ballad type of thing um i can't recall because they've come back a lot already um since they debuted and there's a lot of songs in their discography so i, I can't always recall everything but 100 percent that was amazing and i really really loved it they can really tug on my heartstrings they can really bring in that like emotional side which i think really changes a dynamic for a group is when like sure you can do the fun like party songs but like when you start getting in touch with people's like emotions and stuff it becomes a different type of um attachment's not the right word but like attachment to the fan to like the group or whatever or like your bond with the group if that makes sense because like even especially for just like because they're a band and they do rock music um k-pop rock um that like we growing up <laughs> emo phase emo life you know what i mean sometimes and even just like throughout the entire i don't know like with rock genre in general with the rock genre in general sometimes the more emotional slower down ballad type songs tend to be like maybe not the most remembered from like a lot of different rock groups from like way back when to now but for sure i think they're the ones that the fans attach to the most and are the most just like memorable because it's emotional and stuff and sometimes it's easy to tie that in together so i think they did a really good job getting like an emotional rock ballad and i think they absolutely killed it they absolutely nailed it the vocals are absolutely insane and i think it's one of the best showcases of their vocals um today at least with this song um and i really really liked it they could give me more of this like emotional rock ballad type of stuff and i would be in for it you know what i mean which is interesting because then i think maybe they waited so long to release a song like this because most like k-pop rock groups um they, they it, it's kind of more this is there's not a lot of them but like for sure the more the more popular bands um they, it's more like this more emotional type of stuff that are that they do more and is more popular with them so it definitely makes sense maybe they wanted to stay away from that a little bit or the trend was the more like upbeat more impactful type of stuff but man that ending there i didn't think they were going to do the big sort of just like rock like ending you know what i mean but that was absolutely powerful as well they their music is just it's amazing and i love to see it and they really are unique in terms of in the k-pop world um because they're the only group that i react to that is releasing music like this so um they're not necessarily rock ballads but for sure their entire discography i think is so unique and it's such a breath of fresh air and i absolutely am looking forward so go to your thoughts and comments down below to thought about x and Aaron here is good enough if you like this video give this video a thumbs up if you liked me if you want to see more of my videos go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you want to see my videos the second they come out hit that notification button if you want to follow me on social media twitter instagram tiktok or description down below or at the end screen if you like gaming content i started a gaming channel it's called erica just games links in the description down below i'm currently playing the last of us remastered hope to see over there, share this video with your friends. Thank you guys so much for watching. Love you, and I'll tell you guys later. Bye. Yeah,